All right, so um, I've been working on this for a little bit, but I'm trying to size up a turbocharger for this uh, vehicle. So what I'm doing is, there's a lot of these calculations, you know, from Garrett or otherwise, but I've made a map here in um, Google, Google Sheets, all right? I could share this with people if they're interested. But basically, I've got a bunch of points here that I'm plotting that I'm like, okay, hey, this is, so I think possibly um, based on some calculations, what I think based on the volumetric efficiency of the engine, um, based on where I think I can get a volumetric efficiency, this is what I think I can do. Um, and then I take the mass flow rate of the engine in pounds per minute, and I take the, um, the pressure ratio <clears throat> and I plot them out and then I overlay it over a map of the turbocharger that I am looking at currently um, and right here I've got a really poor fit so I'm way down here on the map right and as RPM decreases and whatnot it's it's just it's not um, the map doesn't go all the way down here but um, it, it's okay in this region but when I start upping the power of the um, that I want to achieve I'm just gonna be down here on the map where really I want to stay inside of the efficiency curve of this. The other thing I don't have here is the map of the, um, is going to be the map. So a lot of people just look at the compressor maps. You really should look at the turbine map too um, to see where you fall on it um, at a specific flow rate uh, and whatnot. But um, your pressure ratio, if you get over here, you're gonna surge. The compressor that is real real bad so you do not want to be on this side of the map over here you're um you're just way less efficient and you're overloading the compressor i don't know if i would call it overload but whatever you want to call it you're you're off the map again on this side so you never want to go to the surge line um of a compressor you will damage them over time it, it's just that's just how centrifugal compressors work um surging them is always always bad you will always screw shit up if you surge a centrifugal compressor. So, um, but yeah, so this would be a non-ideal turbo for my setup. This is going to be related to probably just either um, the turbo is, I don't, I'm doing more research on that side. I don't know if the turbo is too small or too big. Um, I forgot and kind of some of this stuff from years ago when I've done this before. But uh, this is my technique to try to... Uh, size A turbocharger.